Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I will be showing you how to add glitter to your flower fairy doll. This is step six in a six part series that I'm doing that just dives more into the basics of fairy making. I did just launch some fairy kits. If you would like to purchase a fairy kit, I have single fairy kits and then some that come with three flowers. In this tutorial, I'll be using one of the glitter blends that comes in one of my kits. Obviously, if you have your own fairy making supplies, these tips will work for any type of glitter. Okay, let's get started. So in step one, I formed the body. Step two was covering the doll with the floss for the skin. Step three was creating the clothing. Step four was creating the flower skirt. Step five was the hair. And step six is the fun part. You just get to add sparkly, magical glitter. The other supplies that you'll need are something to put the glue and the glitter in. I like using these little plastic lids. I have some Mod Podge, any type of craft glue will work. I have a little paintbrush, and this is going to help us um, apply the glue. You could also use a foam brush. I do prefer using a paintbrush because I feel like you have more control over where you put the glue. And then you'll need something to catch the glitter. And I will forewarn you now, this little tiny piece of paper did not work out well. So make sure you have something big enough to catch the glitter. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is add some glue into one of the little containers. And this was the very end of my glue, so it was kind of sticky and globby, but we'll make it work. And then you're also going to take your glitter and add it into a little dish. Now, the glitter packet that comes in my kit gives you plenty of glitter. Um, this is one of the packets from my kits. This is from the Yellow Dahlia kit. I will be coming out with different seasonal kits and they are um, all limited edition. So uh, if you see one you like, be sure you grab it. So I'm just placing that glitter in my little container. And then we're going to take our fairy doll and I like putting her in the splits. We've got our glue and our glitter and I put her right on the paper. And then you'll also want to gently pull her hair up. You don't want the hair getting in the glue, especially after you took so long smoothing it and creating your fairy hairstyle. So I get a little bit of the glue and one of the things I love doing with my fairies is adding glitter right around her waist. So I'm just taking my glue and I'm lightly painting on a layer of the glue right around her waist. And this just adds the funnest, sparkly, sparkliest pop of color right around the um, her bodice. So you can see up close, I've got just a layer of glue. And then I'm going to take my glitter and I'm going to sprinkle it on top. The other thing you can do is just pick up the entire little plastic thing and dump it over. So you're just covering all of that glue and then I lightly press the glitter down with my fingers to make sure that it sticks to that glue. And you can see I'm carefully holding the hair back, just dabbing that glitter into the glue and then I gently tap it onto my paper. And you can see this is where it would have been a lot smarter to have a bigger piece of paper. And that's it. That's how we do the first way that you can add glitter. One of the new ways I've been adding glitter that's actually one of my favorites is what I will show you next. So I just dump that glitter back into my little container. And for this part, we're going to be adding glue to the tips of the petals. Now, sometimes I do just do this on the top layer of her skirt. Um, with this, it was really fun to add it to the tips of all of those petals. It added the most beautiful sparkly addition to her dress. So I'm just, I dip it in the glue and then I dip it in the glitter. And you can see it just adds a little pop of sparkle to the tip of that petal. The other thing you can do is actually paint the tips of the petals. So whichever is easiest for you. And I usually work in layers. So I'll do um, all the top layer and then I'll move down or I'll start in the front and do all of the front, move to the sides and then the back. You can see up close how pretty that looks and it just kind of pulls the doll together. So I'm just going to continue going around the top layer of the skirt, adding the glitter, dipping the glue into the glitter. And I do that for all of the petals. 
And this is our finished doll. I love her. I think she turned out so beautiful. Um, side note, this auburn hair is the one that comes in my kit and it is my favorite. I have three of my four kids have auburn hair and I absolutely love it. Um, here's a close up of the glitter. This is what I had left after adding glitter to the base of her skirt and to the tips of her skirt. So you do have plenty of glitter in this kit that you can use. Thank you guys so much for watching. That's it. That is the final video in my series. If there are other fairy videos you would like me to go um, into a deeper tutorial where I break it down step by step, please let me know. I would love to help you um, perfect your fairy making skills. If you are interested in purchasing a fairy kit, there will be a link to my Etsy shop below. I have a very exciting kit that I am feverishly working on to get out before Christmas. Hopefully I will be posting that the 1st of November um, and I'm super excited about it. If you are one of my faithful fairy followers, thank you so much. I hope you found this helpful whether you purchase a kit or you're using your own supplies. You guys are the best. If you enjoyed this, give it a thumbs up. If you have comments or questions, please post those below. And if you haven't subscribed, please do. That would be amazing. Thank you again for all of your support and we'll see you next time.